In this video, we are going to show how to use reports and screenshots in GoGuardian Teacher. First, you'll need to log in and access GoGuardian Teacher, and you can start your class. And we'll show how to use screenshots first. So we've got our class opened here and along the tabs along the top, you can click on screenshots. This is where any screenshots will be saved. But first we need to take a screenshot of a student's screen. So we're gonna open up one of our students here in our class and down along the bottom is the screenshot option. And all you have to do is click on the screenshot button and a screenshot will be taken of that student's screen. So we'll see a student has now navigated to YouTube. And if we want to document that, what um, our students are uh, doing, um, what's on their screen, all we have to do is click on screenshot and it will take a quick snap of what is on their screen, what they have open. And then that will be saved on that screenshot tab. So now you can see there's a number two and we've got two screenshots saved um, there. You can click on the save to drive button or the download button to save that um, separate from GoGuardian Teacher if you need access to that um, outside of the GoGuardian Teacher platform. So that's an easy way to save it to your drive or download it so you have access to it elsewhere. So the student reports option on the left menu will give you um, a great overall view of um, student internet activity. You can choose the class, student name, date range, and then generate report. It will show you the top five websites that the students have accessed during that time and uh, their um, documents that they've used. And um, then if you scroll down, there's the screenshots that were taken during that time and as well as a detailed browsing history. And these have clickable links to the actual URLs um, or website addresses that you can click on to access. Um, so it also shows you the top five Google searches. And then you can adjust that date range at the top. Um, there's quick options for one, five uh, days, 14 days, 30 days, and you can go all the way up to six months of data. So you can generate reports for different date ranges to check and then um, generate those. And again, top five websites, documents, and Google searches, as well as intervention data. So this is really cool that GoGuardian teacher shows you how many times you've had to lock a student's screen, open tabs for them, or close out tabs, and any blocked sites that they have accessed during that time. So the number of times that they've opened up a blocked site during that time is available in that report. So that's how you use screenshots and reports in GoGuardian Teacher.